Gordon and the Mechanic. There are railway lines all over the island of Sodor. The railway runs from Brendam Docks right across the countryside. So there are lots of signals. They help the engines to stay safe as they go about their work. All the engines have favorite jobs. Gordon loves pulling the express. Gordon thinks it's the most important job on the island. And Gordon likes to feel important. One morning, Sir Topham Hatt came to see Gordon. Gordon, the points are broken, said Sir Topham Hatt. An important mechanic is coming to fix them. You are to collect him at Marin Station. Then you must take him to the points as quickly as possible. Don't worry, sir, chuffed Gordon. I'll get him to the points for you. Gordon steamed to Marin. All the other engines were stuck. They couldn't go anywhere until the points were fixed. Hurry up, Gordon! They all had to wait as Gordon puffed grandly along the express line. I'm an important engine, collecting an important passenger, he puffed proudly. Gordon felt very grand. Gordon pulled into Marin Station. There was a passenger carrying a toolbox waiting on the platform. He must be the important mechanic, thought Gordon. All aboard, he whistled, and the man with the toolbox climbed on board. Wait, said the station master. Bertie the bus is bringing more passengers. I can't wait, Gordon huffed. I have a very important passenger on board. I have to leave now. And he left. Gordon puffed proudly along. But he didn't know that the man with the toolbox wasn't the mechanic. Or that Bertie the bus had brought the mechanic with all the other passengers. They were still waiting on the platform. Oh no, groaned the mechanic. I've missed my train. How will I ever fix the points now? I'm acting. Gordon rattled past Donald. Then he clattered past Douglas. Important engine coming through, chuffed Gordon. This made Douglas very cross. But the man with the toolbox was having a wonderful time. He was the only passenger, and he didn't have to stop at any of the other stations. At last, Gordon arrived at the broken points. I'm glad you're here, puffed Thomas. None of the engines can move until the points are fixed. But the man with the toolbox was very confused. I'm not the mechanic, said the man. I'm a carpenter. I thought Gordon was taking me to the docks. Oh, no. I've left the mechanic behind, moaned Gordon. I'll have to go back and get him. But you can't reverse down the express line with the express, said the signalman. Maybe you could go on my line, puffed Thomas. That's a good idea, puffed Gordon. Thank you, Thomas. So Gordon backed down the line and left his express coaches. Then he steamed onto Thomas's track. He reversed quickly down Thomas's line. But he found Douglas blocking his way. Out of my way, puffed Gordon. I've got an important passenger to collect. Ah, you can't get past, puffed Douglas. 
I can only go back as far as the next station. Then Donald is in the way. Gordon felt awful. All the engines were stuck, and it was all his fault. How can I collect the mechanic, he puffed. Then Gordon had an idea. Maybe all the engines can help, he thought. Gordon told Douglas his idea. Then Douglas puffed down the track to tell Donald. What a great plan, chuffed Donald. So Donald puffed back to collect the mechanic. The mechanic climbed on board. Then Donald shoved back up the line. Donald left the mechanic at the station. Then Douglas took the mechanic to the next stop where Gordon was waiting for him. Finally, Gordon took the mechanic to the broken point. The points were soon fixed, and all the engines could puff through. Thank you, Gordon, puffed Thomas. That evening, the railway was back to normal. Thank you for helping me today, puffed Gordon. Even an important engine like me needs help, sometimes. Hello, everyone. I'm Thomas. Thank you for watching this remake. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you enjoyed this remake, hit the like button. And if you have a request, go to the comment section down below and comment down what remake would you like to see next. And I'll see you all next time. And remember, little engines can do big things.